We are the keepers of the flame, the sacred order. Let the ceremony begin. And today, Faithful Acolytes, it's time for another. And what this is, is the Willy Pete's, the Raspberry Rain. Dark chocolate infused with Carolina Reapers, filled with Raspberry Reaper Jam. And it's another danger. And we have this kind of cool artwork here. It looks like a bomber plane, possibly. I'm not sure what the meaning here is exactly. Sort of a, looks like the gunner between the two engines, sort of a thing. It's pretty cool. Uh, there is here the Veterans Crisis Line. Pause the screen if you are in need. And we have here the usual stuff. And let's just see, we've got Carolina Reapers for the filling. I'm just looking here to see if it's in the chocolate. It does not appear to be. Filling, white sugar, raspberries, raspberry juice, pectin, lemon, and Reapers. So maybe it's just a filling that has Reapers. I'm not 100% on this. Um, so this, of course, here, we have the artwork created by Roger Trier. And, of course, we know him from the Hot Dang Show. So, this is a League of Fire challenge, and I'm not trying to get the points or anything, but we are going to at least look at the rules. 15-minute challenge, you can see here it is. So there's that, and there's the thing. Uh, so, the challenge is no drink at all, obviously, I guess. Uh, Ten minutes to finish the whole bar, and you can't start at the afterburn until after ten minutes is up, and then a five-minute afterburn. So, you have to wait ten minutes, then wait five minutes. I should be able to... So, so the... I did do the Moab. The Moab was actually... Uh, the prep I did for that was quite good. <laughs> <laughs> and my tolerance was high enough that that was a, that was actually kind of a breeze. This one I understand is supposed to be hotter. Uh, so we have those we have those rules there. Of course, we will be going to the timer as usual, and we will recruit Spidey into the mix. Of course, once we get into that portion of things. But for now, let's crack this baby on open and see what we have here. Okay. Uh oh. We have a busted bar. Oh, we have a very busted bar. Oh. Oh, the wisdom of me. Whoa, what is going on here? The wisdom of me electing to use gloves for this, I feel, is quite pronounced. Okay. Uh, so it's the usual business here. You can kind of see the grid pattern. Okay, so we don't. I. This is good, though, because. I did want to answer one way or the other what these were like. I'm just going to break these up real, real quick here. Didn't mean to do that. That's all right. Oh, this, this will answer it right now. So I wanted to see. So these look like they are a lot more filling. Smells definitely like raspberry jam. Uh, a lot more filling into these than I think the caramel one had. But the caramel was super, super chewy. That obviously is not going to be the case here uh, for this one. So 
Let me grab Spidey over here. All right, here he is. And our timer. Where can we put that? I'm getting crazy bounce here off of the, just with the light that I'm using to film this. Uh, let me adjust this. So I will tell you this, right now I can smell a whole bunch of the Reapers. And uh, I don't know if I can see them in here or not, maybe. It's hard to see because there's not really enough contrast here. And uh, so this was... I was originally thinking this was going to be the last half pound bar I do, the last half pound challenge bar. So this was going to kind of cap, but there is another one floating around out there in the ether. I am kind of interested in doing it. It's not really a challenge bar, I don't think per se, but I do kind of want to do it. But it is 25 bucks a throw. So that one I'll have to just look on and see if I can find it on sale or something. The smell is kind of reminds me of some of the Inferno stuff a bit. And uh, <laughs> I was psyched up. I was ready to go for this until I got into it. Now, I'm <laughs> well, we'll see how much hotter it is, I guess. So I'm going to click this on. All right. So there we go. And I'm see if we can knock this out in 10 minutes. It was immediately higher. Much higher. I think the record was Molly Shiler again, who did it in like a minute and a half. <clears throat> we won't be doing that. This could be a little bit of a video on the longer side of things as well. Not. We'll see. It is easier to eat like I thought it would be. The Moab. Um, heat. All right. Heat right now is a little bit over one. The ratio is not bad here. <clears throat> it is a touch on the sweet side. I'm not sure how much I like this jam either. Okay. We're at the halfway mark now, and uh, I'm, I'm about to. So, the time for the Moab, if I wouldn't have been lollygagging so much towards the end of that one, as it was, I think my ranking was just just out of the top 100. This one's kind of set on at least 15 minutes, of course. But. Starting to get a good blaze now. I mentioned this in the community notes, but As part of the prep for this, I had a 
actual Reaper pod. My first ever. I have pieces of the pepper here and there. First time for a whole pod. We're about three now. Our pound of chocolate is just a lot of sweet. But it's not sticking to my teeth like last time with the Moab. So that's good. Sweating a bit. Nose to run a bit. Oh. Definitely chili head only bar. No question about that. Ooh. Uh. Okay. Ah, tired of the flavor. After that other half on bar, if I find it lower priced enough, that will probably be it though. This is so much sweet. Uh. Oh. 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 So far, this is easier to do than the other one, though, by a lot. Is it higher? Probably a little bit. Uh, uh. Last one. <laughs> Burn my throat a little bit. I'm just wiping my uh, <clears throat> nose a bit there. Huh. Eyes watering a lot. Oh. Pulsinate tinnitus. It's really burning the back of my throat. Let's wrap it up. All right. Oh, hey. Twenty more seconds. Okay. We're gonna let it go to fifteen.
That's so much sweet. Ugh. Just torching the back of my throat. I don't know why. Sweating. I'm sweating a lot. Um, okay, so I put that probably between a three and a four. It was de definitely notably hotter than the other one. And it was hotter faster. It's, it's tapering a lot now, though. So the afterburn is... I guess less of a burn. The pulsonate tinnitus is wearing off. Uh, yeah, just hyper sweet. Uh, half pound of chocolate, something like this, is thirteen hundred to fourteen hundred calories. And it's it's a lot to slam all at once, and these aren't good challenges, I don't think, to do. If you have any risk of, like, type 2 diabetes, because that's a lot of insulin that has to be poured in to compensate for all that sugar. One of the major, like, the main reason I don't want to do these anymore is because there's not any that I've seen that I'm interested in doing. There's one more challenge I might try to get to this year. And then maybe that other half pound bar at some point. Just because it sounds interesting. But... This it's just a it's just a lot. It's just a lot at once. And that I think is my biggest issue with this. Alright, we're over 15. Thank you for your service, Kindle. Okay, so I shaved not quite four minutes off uh of the uh, Moab. So let's see. I'm gonna look at the rankings here and just kind of see where 938 would put us. All right, 9.38. Oh, hey, Steve Gillespie. Keep my shorts. Interesting. So he's... Oh, it looks like he's fast on this with 2.18. Interesting. Molly is... Uh, no, Molly's 1.26. So 9.38 would put me in... Sixth place, not for time, but because of points. As far as speed, it would be down there a bit, I think. It's really hard to tell the way this is arranged. Huh. Maybe a lot of people aren't doing that challenge, I don't know. But yeah, so, yeah, I, I'm not going to do a bunch of collecting... I'm not going to do a whole bunch of collecting points for the League of Fire because I like I just don't think that that's something I, I'm ever going to do. I mean, it's cool. It's fine. You know, more, more power to whoever wants to do it. I know I know uh, Jeremy Eisenburn likes to do those as well. And, uh, you know, awesome. That's I, it's it's cool. It, it, it is not for me, though. Just just not my thing. Although I do look on there for challenges. I try to. I try to follow the guidelines of the challenges there and try to find stuff. I, I try to mine it for stuff that'd be interesting to do content on. But uh, I've done three half pound chocolate bars, all of them from Willy Pete's. All of them are in the spicy chocolate bar playlist if you want to check out the other two. And uh, I got maybe one more half pound bar left in me, maybe. But. Uh, Definitely, I don't. I don't know if it's a challenge bar or not. But as far as this year, I've done a number of challenges. 
and that was kind of fun, but there's only one more that I really am interested in doing. So I might do that. Hopefully I can do that one before the end of the year, somewhere in there. And then I'm probably, unless something really changes, I'm, I'm probably not going to be looking for challenges too much more. Uh, it just isn't anything I'm super interested in. But as for this one, um, it, yeah, it was a little bit easier. I will say that. It was definitely hotter, but it was a little bit easier than the Moab. Uh, the Moab was a much more difficult challenge in terms of the quantity at once. This one was a lot easier to eat. Uh, it was quite a bit hotter, and I think this one, it took me a little bit further into the bar just before all that sugar started to get to me. Uh, and I've been trying to tune myself specifically for Reapers just for this bar as well. So that one, I think I think you definitely have to key yourself for Reapers more so with this one than the other one. So in that respect, it can be a bit more difficult. Uh, Flavor-wise, uh, the other one would have been pretty intolerable without the salt I added to it. This one, um, I didn't add any salt to it, obviously. It, 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 it's good, but it is very, very hyper-sweet. Uh, so... Flavor wise, I, I would say I liked I like this one slightly better, I think, than the Moab, but not by any great amount. Uh they were definitely very interesting. Th these are interesting challenges to prep for because again, you've got quantity and you've also got the heat as well to to try to to try to balance stuff out. So uh yeah. It it was it was fun to do. I don't Think I'm gonna I certainly won't be repeating Moab and I won't be doing this one again either. So one and done, we knocked it out, we did the thing. Uh I think we would have qualified for seven points or whatever it is. So uh yeah, there we go. We'll just leave it right there. So there was the Willie Pete's Raspberry Rain Challenge Chocolate Bar. Number four. In peace to serve the flame.